Hello. So I always get this question, Sakshi, what actually you eat? Because people have this curiosity because I'm vegan. So here I am sharing some of the dishes that I eat throughout my week. So first dish is my favorite kale lettuce salad. It's really simple. First you have to take kale. It's my favorite leafy vegetable. So instead of using knife, I'm using my hand because this preserves its nutrients. Now here I'm struggling. Huh. I can never cut tomato without struggling. I don't know why. So here I have included more vegetables but I forgot to shoot it. So there is lettuce, tomato, spinach and again rice and the main ingredient lemon. I can't go without lemon. I just need lemon in my every dish. Pick out the seeds. Here comes the hero of the dish. It's peanut dressing. It's made using only three ingredients, roasted peanuts, salt and red chili and water and you have to just grind it in a mixer or food process or whatever you like. So your first dish is ready. Coming on to second dish, broccoli collie salad. First you have to put all the vegetables and then you have to boil broccoli collie and green peas. Now here I am setting all the vegetables in the bowl because I have to present it to you all. Otherwise I am not eating these salads as I am showing, okay. Uh, there is quinoa, broccoli, cauli, green peas and again peanut dressing. That's it. Coming on to third dish or meal or whatever you like to call it. It's very easy to make. You have to just cut all your fruits wherever your preferred fruit is here today i had strawberries that's why i cut strawberry um i like to add any kind of vegetables leafy vegetables that i have at home today i had spinach so i'm cutting spinach here's a fact i actually don't like eating fruits now but i'm still including them because i know they are good for health Sometimes you have to do anything for your health. Okay, here I'm adding spinach first because it's very necessary to add green leafy vegetables first because they require more time to grind. Whatever. Then I then I add strawberries. Now I'm gonna add ice, and I like to have frozen fruit. Banana is my preferred one. I always have frozen bananas at my home. Okay, now I'm adding frozen bananas. Because the, this gives your smoothie a very nice consistency. Thick consistency which I very much like. Okay, here I'm adding soy milk. You can also add almond milk, cashew milk, whatever you like. Also normal milk. Okay. After all, after mixing all these ingredients, this is what we get. It was really tasty. Okay, now here I'm presenting the struggle. Okay, it was really tasty though. Coming on to our fourth dish, yogurt strawberry oats. This is my all-time favorite. I don't like mango yogurt though, but. I always order blueberry yogurt because mango is not my favorite fruit. Uh, it's very controversial. Okay. okay, first you have to cook your oats. Then take out the yogurt from the cup. Simple. It's really simple dish. I have cut strawberries because obviously strawberries were at home. Okay, you can add any fruits you like. Okay, because Oats is such a good dish to make because it goes with everything. You can make it salty, you can make it sweet. That's it for oats. I think I can talk about oats for hours. Here I have added soy milk. It's my favorite meal. Okay. 
last dish or meal or whatever i don't know why i'm showing this because it's really easy you have to just add water coffee and soy milk and just give it a good shake and that's it it's ready but i have this thing every day that's why i wanted to show this i'm adding soy milk because i like soy milk i like taste it's not overpowering that's why huh. it was nice give it a good shake sakshi that's it hope you like this video don't forget to like share subscribe and comment bye till next video comes up